<laughs> Kenneth, bag your names. Secret Santa. Secret Santa. Kenneth is doing a Secret Santa fun swap thing. Ugh, he takes the two worst parts of Christmas, giving and rules, and combines them. And then the person with the highest number gives the smallest gift to the tallest person. If they want to switch, they cannot. Unless they do, then everyone puts their head down except the murderer. Oh, wait, that's not right. The whole thing was so confusing, I ended up getting my own crappy gift back. Like I need two copies of Over 60 Vixens. Mr. Ossetano, would you like to participate in our studio-wide Secret Santa fun swap? I totally would do Secret Santa, but I don't believe in Christmas because I'm a Verdukian. Yes, we are all very strict Verdukians. Oh, my apologies. I've never heard of that religion. What do y'all believe in? Oh, many things. Uh, the healing power of root beer. That a man can have up to nine wives if two of them are male. And we always leave work to go to the movies on Merlin Peen. So good Merlin Peen to you, Kenneth. Good Merlin Peen. Good Merlin Peen. What's with all the junk, Ken? Well, these are my all-inclusive holiday decorations. Here's a little Christmas tree. OK. A menorah. A picture of President Obama. For the Muslims. Go and let that one slide. And a bowl of meat cubes with a picture of Jimmy Connors sticking out in the tradition of Verdukianism. Verdukianism? That doesn't make sense. Jimmy is Catholic. Ah, good Merlin Peen, gentlemen. Good, good Merlin, Merlin Peen. So you guys are Verdukian. Yep, that's why we can't do Secret Santa. Mm-hmm. Then sing that Verdukian winter carol, the famous one. Oh, oh me, Paul of Verduke, you bring me such pizza. What's up, Special K? Having a party? Not me, sir. Tonight is the Verdukian Holiday of Mouth Pleasures. Mr. Rossitano Spurlock and Lutz must have free sausage pizza, followed by some gentle flossing performed by a blonde virgin. Your generosity is being taken advantage of. What do you mean? Verdukianism is fake. Those dudes made it up because they didn't want to do Secret Santa. But they had all these rules and rituals. That's what religion is, K-Fed. Just a bunch of made-up rules to manipulate people. Why don't Catholics eat meat on Fridays? I'll tell you why. Because the Pope owns Long John Silvers. Wait a minute. Are you saying that other religions are made up by man, too? Oh, Ken. We may have fallen into the intellectual deep in here. And if you try to grab onto me, we'll both drown. What if there's no God? OK, time to go. You're just a Kenny Rogers doll now. Something you want to say? We want to do Secret Santa. Yay! Secret Santa has been canceled because I have lost my faith. But something's changed in us. It's, it's a Christmas miracle. That certainly proves God exists. If God existed, then he would punish you for what you did to me. And yet, here you are, unpunished. Ergo, our actions have no consequences. So if you'll excuse me, I'm going to go buy some guitar music. All right, which of you are Frank Rosatano and James Spurlock? That's us. Are we? They're under arrest. What do we do? Uh, what? Someone called in a bomb threat from your phone this morning. I renounce for Dukeanism. What? What's that mean? Are you Al Qaeda? Come here, pal. <laughs> My angry God is punishing them. It's a Christmas miracle. <laughs>